Good morning, Year 8. It's Miss Fleming, and this morning I'm going to be talking to you about our GCSE Physical Education course. The WJC course is a combination of practical and theory work. In Years 9 and 10, we look at the relationship between health and fitness and how to lead a healthy lifestyle. We then look in depth at what constitutes fitness, including testing, training methods, and how to devise and carry out a fitness training programme. In Year 11, we focus on individual activities, working towards the practical moderation in the spring term. After this, the emphasis is on theory work, where we cover topics such as body, nutrition, motivation and technological developments in sport, and many more. The practical assessment is continuous and is made up of three activities accounting for 50% of a final mark. One of the activities must be a team sport, the second must be an individual sport, and the third can be one of the other. The theory assessment makes up the other 50% and is in the form of a written exam. This will take two hours. These include short answered questions, multiple choice questions, and some extended writing questions. So if you'd like to take GCSE PE, where will it take you? This course gives an excellent foundation of knowledge in many areas of health and fitness and sport in general, which can benefit the individual in everyday life and can lead to a variety of career paths. A former pupil explained, GCSE PE is a good subject to take because if you love being active, you can find out more about how to improve your performance. The theory lessons cover a range of topics such as physiology, psychology and social culture, which gives you a range of exciting career opportunities when you leave school. Former PE students have gone on to careers in many areas such as professional sport, physiotherapy, coaching, teaching, environmental work, citizenship, medicine, journalism, the list is endless. Please watch the next video which shows many different athletes who took GCSE PE and they will explain the impact that course had on their careers. I'm Callum James, I'm a Cardiff Blues Academy player. When I was in school I took GCSE PE and I'm that gave me the opportunity to have a full-time rugby contract. Hi there, my name's Tom. I studied PE at school and went on to study sports management at university. I now work within the cycling events industry, uh, leading and managing tours throughout the UK, Europe and Asia. Lewis Crabb, WRU Rugby Hub Officer at Brintilly and Comprehensive School Bridgend. Following studying GCSE and A-Level P at Tom Rever Comprehensive School, I moved on to study sports studies at University of Glamorgan, where I graduated with a 2-1 degree. Following my studies, I landed a job with Rhonda Schools Rugby as a local development officer, working within 32 primary schools and also worked closely with the Delalio Foundation. Following this job, I moved. I was lucky enough to secure a job with the WRU as a hub officer, uh, organising all the rugby within a secondary school. Ni Hao from China, my name's Adrian, I studied sport and PE at school, then continued it at university, and I'm now a strength and conditioning coach at the Shanghai Institute of Sport. Let's go get massive. Hey guys, Jack here, I'm 24. Just letting you guys know that I did PE at school. I went on to further my studies in Cardiff, where I studied sport management. Uh, since then, that's allowed me to travel the world, and I'm based here now on the sunny Gold Coast, down in Australia, where we've just hosted the Commonwealth Games. Sport has not only helped me with my career, but it's helped me socially, building friends and networking all over the world. Um, it's also given me a career path, which has allowed me uh, visa sponsorship. And here's my office. It's 36 today, and that's a pretty cold one. As well as celebrating success within the faculty, we also feel it's important to provide unique opportunities to our learners. As well as having a busy extracurricular timetable, we have organised several activities and experiences for many. These include an annual skiing trip, a trip to Manchester City to play on the stadiums and have some training sessions with some professional coaches, as well as going to watch a live basketball game. 
we hope that you guys can get involved in the near future. If you'd like any further information regarding the GCSE PE course, then please come and see myself, Miss Fleming, or any other member of the faculty. You can either come and see us in our office during break or lunch, or you can give us an email asking for any particular questions. We look forward to welcoming you to the course.